Hey, peace and blessings. I'm Giovanna, the spiritual love coach, and I wanted to answer a very important question, and that is, what is spiritual love? So there's a reason why I put spiritual in front of the word or phrase love coach, and that's because I did not want it to be confused. I really wanted to make a statement and a change in how we perceive love and how we relate to ourselves and each other. So love has gotten a really bad rap. When we think about love, there's like phrases like love is pain, love hurts, love is blind, and all of these different things. So there's a lot of fear and negative energy around the word love. And that's a problem. So I didn't want to be just a love coach because also being in an abusive relationship, I wanted, I really like was thinking like, what do I want in a relationship going forward? Like what type of love is it that I want to call into my life? And the thing is, I was in an abusive relationship with someone who said they loved me. So I was like, I don't want that kind of love. Like I want that divine love that is deep and meaningful and comes from a place of love and peace and protection not that negative drama filled deceitful love that has kind of become the norm in a way right so I feel like there's a big stain on love and how we relate to ourselves as well as how we're relating to others so that's where the spiritual love coach came from is that I really want people to understand that love does not hurt that love is beautiful that it is deep that it is meaningful and that love is actually an energy but most importantly love does not come from someone else yes it feels good when we do have that connection with another person but ultimately love is within love was already planted within you when you were created here so I really just wanted to highlight what love truly is and kind of restore love back to its sacred nature where it seems like it's kind of gotten a bad rap so spiritual love is all about reclaiming the true intended purpose for love it's also about recognizing the divine the god or goddess within self as well as within another so it's deeper than just like I love you when you recognize that we are all spiritual beings that we were are all you know images of God created right here in the flesh you start to treat yourself differently and you start to treat others differently and in return you get treated differently right so spiritual love is really about going deeper with love it's not just surface level it's really getting to the heart of the matter going deeper truly getting to know and understand somebody so the other thing about spiritual love is that it is limitless it is inclusive and it is unconditional the thing about love we say we love people but we have so many conditions well i love you but that's a condition that is a limit and love is inclusive that means it includes every being on this earth everything is worthy and deserving of love so with that being said i really wanted to encompass that spiritual love is not about oh well, i'll only love you if you do this or um I love you but you need to change it's recognizing and accepting the divine in each of us in each person and it is truly beautiful um, I had drafted something and I wanted to find it and share it with you because I really thought it was beautiful where I kind of just really explain like spiritual love to me it's divine it is sacred it is soulful it is all encompassing it's not this every day oh i love you today and then tomorrow i don't love you love has become something that is fleeting it's temporary it is painful it's embarrassing and that's not truly what love is so part of my work as the spiritual love coach is really to restore love to 
again to its intended purpose everything that i do <laughs> is for a bigger purpose it's um amazing to see how i have transformed how my work is transforming but um I'm just excited to share this message and I really chose spiritual love because love again has gotten watered down and has had a lot of negative and fearful energies attached to it. We also forget that love is not limited to romantic relationships or dating. Love is about yourself, it's about your family, it's about your friends, it's about the world around you and how you relate to it. So. I've been loved by people who have hurt me in different ways. I've been in an abusive relationship. And I was like, that's not the type of love that I want. I want a deeper love the way that God or divine source intended it to be. So for me, spiritual love is recognizing that love is energy. It is a spiritual or energetic recognition, acceptance, and honoring of the divine in yourself and in others and it rejects the ideas that love hurts that it's painful that love is blind it rejects the idea of love that we're seeing as normalized where it has limits and has conditions and it excludes people so that is what spiritual love is about it's about accepting that love is a deep connection that recognizes the divine god and goddess within so I hope that this helps you better understand what spiritual love is all about. No, it's not just about dating and relationships, although I do understand that that is ultimately what we want. One of our basic needs is for human connection. And that's why so many of us feel the need to like find love or um, to be loved and I as the spiritual love coach want you to realize that you are already loved and that you have love within you and it's when we tap in to that reserve of love that we really start to unearth and rediscover who we are and we can kind of rebirth ourselves into this new way of being this more elevated state to where you're not seeking something because you already know who you are and what you deserve and then you magically just start to attract all these amazing things to you so i hope that you enjoyed this video visit me over at the spirituallovecoach.com we will be doing a um, freedom to excuse me journey to forgiveness challenge in the next couple of weeks and i would love for you to join me um, while we work through some forgiveness so if that's something that you're interested in um, visit spirituallovechallenge.com and you can sign up there peace